my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're a family. I'm dead. Look at her. Oh my god. Yes. Hello, Cyberlife. This is, uh, this Cat Squad again. Cat, you know, representing the squad. Um, today I want to ask you one question. Why is Connor so awesome? I mean, I'm not even talking about, like, how, you know, his abilities and things like that. I'm talking about why is he just so awesome as a character. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Okay, cool. Good to know. But he's my son. He's Mr. Good Hair. And we all know that Connor is Bay. That's right. That's right, folks. Also, Hank's pretty cool, too. Mr. Krabs? Yeah. He's cool. He's cool. Thanks. Thanks for letting me know. Okay. Bye, Cyber Life. See you later. Talk to you later. Hello everybody, my name is Couch, and guys, welcome back to Miss Guest Squad, and guys, today we're continuming to try to become human. And as you guys notice, again, my hair is this color. Why? Because I want to represent Miss Mama, and that basically means, who am I representing? Who am I representing? As you know, Kara. That's right, Kara. I want to do whatever I can to represent this series as much as possible. Don't worry, it's just a little spray on, so it's not permanent if you guys are like, no, I kind of like your hair before, but you know, you know, I might, on Patreon, I might let you guys vote on what kind of hairspray I should be doing next, because that was something that we used to do on Miss Cat Squad way back when. If you want to check back, check out what I used to make the patrons do to me. Oh, God. Hold on for a second. I'm getting a call. Yes? Ring your ding ding. Hello? Oh. Hey, you, you, you want me to continue on with the whole, uh, Patreon type thing? Yeah? You, you, you guys want me to do some kind of challenge? Is that right? Okay. I'll keep you posted. What kind of challenges would you like me to do? Okay. Okay, I'll see you later. Goodbye, Patreon. My, 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 my wonderful patrons. Goodbye. Yes. Alright, so, uh, that was just the patrons calling, and, um, basically on Patreon, if you guys say to me, Cat, do this with your hair, or Cat, do that with that, but anyway, guys, another reason I did this also because um, I'm actually planning, which I don't want to say anything about it, but I'm going to because I'm really passionate about this project that I am actually really want to work on. I want to really make a comic, and if you guys know, I'm a big fan of comics. I'm a big nerd that way, geek culture. So uh, my main character that I'm planning on uh, creating has this type of hair color, and that's why I said I just I just want to represent as much as possible by embracing my inner fangirl, fanboy, every single day. So I'll keep you guys posted on that too, because that's, that's just another project I want to add to the mix of going full time, and it'd be great. It'd be great to get that idea published one. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, the phone is ringing. Hello? Oh hey Julie, how you doing? How do you- how do you feel about, uh, editing these episodes? Do, do you love them? <laughs> that's right, that's right. Uh, how, what do you think- what do you think about the Trophy Computing so far? Alright. That's cool. That's cool. I'll talk to you later. Keep up the great work. Goodbye. Bye bye Alright, uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, Lava Lamb Chan and I are ready for this. This is what happened last time. I can't believe. I failed. I should've caught it. Let's get out of here. This place makes me sick. Yep. Crap! Oh no. We failed. Last time it was um, extremely painful to see that I failed the mission. Yet again. So I hope that doesn't. I, that probably won't go over well with Amanda because I feel as if I continuously fail these missions that uh, she may shut Connor down and that's not gonna be fun. But anyway guys, let's keep going. December is that what? November seventh, two thousand thirty-eight. I wonder how many days. My knees are getting vibrated. I wonder how many days pass up. Oh, oh my God! They're in a mommy van. We're neutral. Distant. Crap! I'm not a good mother. Let's see. Hey, this is so cute. They're our family. Destination. Distance. Car. It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. Yeah, I'll just take it. I wouldn't Grand Theft Auto. It's cold. Oh. I saw it once in the garage. God, I shipped them so much to stop oh, it. Oh, Zlatko even never used it. Oh my God, they're a family. They're a family. I'm so happy. Uh, destination, distance, weather. Aw. 
never seen snow before. Really? It's pretty. It's slowing us down. Oh my god, stop. The chemistry is real. But at least we won't meet any humans along the way. <laughs> hey, baby. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids Laco captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. You believe them, though. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? Yeah. All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zlatko killed them. Oh, God. Eyes on the road! I know my daughter is pretty, but still. Oh. Metal function detected. Emergency brakes activated. What? Oh, it's so cool, though. Why? What's the malfunction? What's going on, guys? This doesn't look good. Oh, heck no. Oh, that is so freaking cool. You good? Stay inside, Alice. Mommy and Daddy are gonna take care of this. Mommy and Daddy are gonna take care of this. We got you. Hubby. Oh my god, look at- Oh my god! Oh my god, the size difference! Oh my god, I'm dying. Okay, let's see. Let's examine. The car's gonna fix it. Oh. But how? Is it because of the snow? Just like, eh, eh. What are we going to do? Hmm. I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. <laughs> we have to find somewhere to spend the night. This, oh my god. This is like real life you problems that parents would go through. Okay. Alice. Speedy. Ugh, mommy and daddy have to go find a place. And we're not going to leave you in the car. We're going to freeze. Going to. Am I gonna just continuously walk? Go, Carl. Go, my girl. Go, Miss Mama. There's, oh god, it, it is just like. Oh my god, it's beyond two souls all over again when it's snowing and you're trying to find shelter. Pirates! Why is everything referred to pirates? Is it pirates in? Pirates hotel? Lay low. Over there. Hmm. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, they're a family! I'm dead! Look at her! Oh my god! Her and his arms. Oh my god, I'm dead. He's so big. I love it. Pirates Cove. Is this like an amusement? We need to find shelter. Screaming, you scare me. Why? What is wrong? We have to get out of the cold. Yeah. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. He's screaming. He's screaming. This way. Uh, that? Yeah. That would be nice. Wait. Why are you sta- Dude. Luther. Why are you <laughs> He's just standing right there? Um. Okay, so we gotta find sh Oh my god, he's freaking huge. What is he, like seven feet? Oh my god. But again, I ship it. Da -da -da. You know me when I get ships. You guys know if you watch Uncharted, you know the ships. <laughs> Let's see. Well, there's no shelter in there. Find anything? By shelter? No. no place we could spend the night. You know what I'm saying? Oh my god, cat, stop it with you and your stupid ships. Let's see, what is this? Find anything! <laughs> He's screaming. <laughs> we got, we got, we got mama. Anything? Do windy for Alice. Yeah. I mean, I know they're fine, but. Oh my god, yes! Beware! Yes! Danger always comes when least expected. No. I'm scared. I'm scared! And my battery's low! Crap! Um. When I least expected? Oh. Oh, guys. 
What is that a warning of? What is he warning us? Um. Ha! Wait, didn't I just check this? Oh, what's that? Come on. Too small for the three of us. <laughs> just toss her in there. <laughs> toss her daughter in there, it's fine. <laughs> Place is falling apart. Yeah. It's not gonna be easy to find shelter. I know. But we'll find it. Mama will prevail. I mean, my only concern is that what if she gets sick? Aha! That's kind of like a house thing. Looks like yes! Let's go get it! Oh my god, look what I found. I, I, again, I'm gonna have to read all of these. We, USS Iowa. Gossip. Gossip. All Android banned. Oh. My. Lord. I'm dead. I love it. I love it. All Android banned. I like the boy band. I'm like, can I be a part of <laughs> Let's see. Oh. Do -do -do -do. What we got? Oh. Check gun. What? Offer cookie. Oh, yeah. There are some cookies left. Oh. Would you like some? No, I'm not hungry. Why? No. She's trying. Check gun. You have a weapon now. I'm so sad. She didn't want a cookie. I'm so distant from her. This is so sad. Um, oh. What is that? Do -do -do -do. Oh, I just looked at that. I know, Kara, I know you're a fan of the boy bands, but still. Wee -be -be. Let's see. Looks like I could probably look at the window. there I love it oh my god look at her carry the stuff this is what I love about Quantic Dreams games you actually have to carry stuff um let's see aha please I want to be her friend I want to be the mommy she's still distant from me I don't appreciate that no Alice Everyone else. 
long as we're together, that's all that matters. Oh, we're neutral now. Let's get you to bed. Oh, I'm so happy. Go to bed, sweet. What was that? Oh, that was, again, I know what that was. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at the nugget. Oh. Sleep tight, Alice. Oh. Sweet dreams. Oh. A warm. Oh. Oh. Can you tell me a story, Clara? Oh my god. With those eyes, it's just like, ah. Oh. I have 9,000 children's stories in, <laughs> in memory. I should have one for you. Hmm. Princess Unicorn. Unicorn! This is a story about a unicorn that. No. Which one? Not a story like that. Like what? Make one up for me. Oh. Aww. This is a story about a little girl who was tired of being afraid. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but the shadow that lived within her kept her from being happy. Then she met a robot who was just as lost as the little girl so they decided to run away together to find a place where they could be safe they encountered great dangers along the way this is so precious they were so brave that they escaped all of them Along the way, they met Aww. another robot Aww. who left his master to become their guardian. Mm. How does the story end? Oh my god. I don't know. But all stories have morals. When we reach the end of ours, we'll know what it really meant. Oh. Oh, that's so precious. Are you going to come say good night, Oh my god, it's like, oh my god. Yes. Oh. Yes, of course. He's the dad. They're a family. Oh, oh I ship them so much. Oh my god, my heart. Night, Alice. Sleep tight. Oh my god. Oh, this game knows where to hit you. Uh, talk to Luther. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> She's a sweet girl. Yes. She's very brave. Oh. Do you remember anything from your life before Zlatko? No. My model was designed to carry heavy loads. Hmm. I might have been a longshoreman or a laborer. Oh. Who I was doesn't matter anymore. It wasn't really me. It's still snowing. We have a long walk tomorrow. We better leave early if we want to avoid being seen. Kara, have you ever noticed anything mm -hmm. about Alice? Yes. Yes, of course. She's a wonderful little girl. I mean, I don't know many little girls, but Aww. I think she really is special. Yeah. Oh, for the love of God, can they not have peace? Kara! Why? What the heck's going on? What do they want? What do they want? Oh, they like zombies. I like zombie androids. There we go. We gotta fight these mofos. 
get Alice. Yes! Huh? We don't want to hurt you. Okay, then why did you break in the doors like that? We're just like you. Our name is Jerry. Our name? We were working here before the park closed. Oh. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted uh... to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. Oh. We haven't seen one for a long time. Oh. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in. She should follow us then. Oh. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Hi, idea. Cara. <laughs> I don't think you have any choice. <laughs> Thank God this isn't bad. Oh! <laughs> Uh, at least this is a good episode. Oh, here we go. All of the Jerry's. Oh, this is a car. Is it the carousel? Be our guest. Oh my God. They are so nice. Little one can climb on board. Oh. The carousel is about to begin. Oh. Don't pick her up. <gasps> this is too much for me. Oh my god. We needed this. We needed this. We needed this chapter. Okay. Oh God. Oh. I feel like could, could something have bad happened. I don't know, but oh, thank God. Let's keep going. That they needed this moment. They really needed that. I needed that. Yeah. <laughs> Hank, friend. Here we are. He's <laughs> sitting there. <laughs> such, such good posture. <laughs> Hank. Where are you, Hank? Where did you go? I'm sitting right there. Ah, I can, but what was over here? What is that? Is that a magazine? <gasps> yes, it is! Sentry. Yes, the mysterious Mr. Kamaski. Kamski. Kamski? What? Markets predict war. Okay. I love how it's like an extra like collectible type thing, but... Oh, Hank. You're gonna be, he's gonna be pissed. Is he gonna be mad? Is he gonna be mad? <laughs> Hey, buddy. Hey. Oh. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Oh. 
Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. Oh no! It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Before what? Hmm? <laughs> you said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places? Well, there must be some link. Maybe. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. Yeah. It's almost like some kind of myth. Hmm. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. The androids believing in God. Oh. Fuck. What's this world coming to? Really? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? I wish we had found that girl that killed that guy. Maybe she had a reason. Maybe she was just defending herself. It didn't want anything, Lieutenant. It was a deviant. That's all there is to it. What about you, Connor? Oh, no. Ike? You look human. You sound human. I'm scared. But what are you really? I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. <laughs> Aww. Your partner? Your buddy to drink with? Oh. Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task. Nothing else matters to you but your goddamn investigation, huh? Uh, no doubts. No mistakes. No weaknesses. Human being just like me. Only perfect. <laughs> I'm sorry, but... I don't see what you're getting at. Oh, what? I could kill you. Huh? And you would just come back as if nothing happened. Huh? But are you afraid to die, Connor? I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. Okay, software. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Huh? Hmm? Huh? His software. Nothing. What happened? Where? Oblivion. His software. Android heaven. Android heaven. Nothing. There would be nothing. No. Yes, we're friends. Where are you going? To get drunker. No. I need to think. See, his son's death really, really hurt him. Oh my god! He could have died! He could have died! Okay, guys, we we're gonna stop here because my heart was like, oh my god, that one right down there probably was like, hey, like Kent killed Connor or something. Oh, thank god I saved their friendship, though. Oh, Hank, you're so hard to get along with, but. Ah. Uh, I, for one, I'm questioning. Guys, I'm questioning this. What did it mean by software? Is he gonna become a deviant? Everyone else has, but Connor so far, so, hmm. <laughs> but my, my only thing is, this was such a precious episode because of what happened with Alice. She deserved it so much. And what makes me so happy is the fact that she's finally getting the family that she wants, and she smiled. 
And now I think we're, we're warm. It's fine. It went from distant to warm in one episode. But I'm so I get so anxious whenever I have to answer any of the questions because I get like, oh god, oh god above, please help me here, please help me because I want to make sure that Hank and Connor remain friends. That's all that matters to me. <laughs> No, I want, I want everyone to have um, good friends with Marcus. Seems like everyone went down for him, but then he gave that motivational speech in the last episode that went like this. And literally, I was so proud of Marcus to say, you know what? At least we tried. And fist bump to that, at least we tried. But anyway, guys, I hope you have an amazing day. You stay safe out there. And as always, best cats, until the next video, embrace your own fan girl and your own fan boy every single day. Oh, so precious. My precious bee. <laughs>